Hello, I'm Matt and welcome to Badger Workshop. My workshop is based at a country pub that also does bed and breakfasts. They're always asking me to do things around the place and the most recent thing is to do something for one of the hotel rooms. It's a little small so they've asked me to do a nightstand corner shelf. So let's get started. As you can see the room is a bit tight for space so the first thing to do is get the old bedside table out of the way. I'm checking to see if the corner is actually square, but of course that would be too easy and it's not. I'm using a sliding bevel to determine the actual angle of the corner. With the angle determined, I've made a template for the bedside table out of a bit of cardboard, then I can just trace it onto some plywood ready to be cut out. I'm ripping down a sheet of plywood to the correct size. then chopping it down on the mitre saw. I'm using the band saw to cut the curve out. Cutting out two pieces so the nightstand can have a shelf. I clamp both pieces in the vise and then using the random orbital sander sand down to the pencil line. just cutting the back pieces and the side pieces for the shelf. To attach the sides to the base I'm just gluing and then brad nailing them on. And then I can attach the top, which again I'm just gluing and brad nailing. The excess wood on the side and the back I'm just cutting off with a handsaw. Then sanding it to a nice curve. I'm using a roundover bit in the router to give the front a nice curved edge. Drilling a hole in the back corner so that a cord for a bedside lamp can be run through it. I'm putting some marks on the back and the side. Then putting some holes on the marks. Later these holes are what I'm going to put screws through to attach it to the wall. That's all the construction done, so now a coat of undercoat. Then two coats of gloss. I also gave it two coats of varnish to make it extra hard wearing for a hotel room. I'm holding it up at the same level as what the other table was at. Making sure it's level and then just making marks where the holes need to go. It's a bit tricky to work in such a tight space, but then I can put holes in the wall where I've made my marks and put some plugs in to attach it to. Then it could just be screwed onto the wall. That's it all done. The client was pleased with how it turned out and it made the room look a lot bigger. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more.